Right now at 5.30, concern in a Queens community after the man accused in the shooting death of a Chinese food delivery worker is released on bail. Good evening, I'm Christine Johnson. Welcome back, I'm Maurice Dubois. Authorities say the suspect went after the delivery worker over duck sauce. CBS 2's Jenna DeAngelis takes us inside the hearing at Queens County Criminal Court. Glenn Hirsch entered the courtroom surrounded by members of the New York State Court's special response team. The 51 year old, charged with stalking and murdering Zewin Young, a 45 year old father and restaurant worker, was released on bail Monday. Court said $500,000 cash bail. The judge spelling out the terms. You are not being released to walk around Queens County. Hirsch will be under electric monitoring and must stay home with few exceptions. Court, appointments with his doctor or attorney, and one hour of daily exercise. He's prohibited from areas, including where he allegedly shot Young during a delivery in April, and Great Wall Chinese Restaurant, where prosecutors say he stalked and threatened workers. If you go into that area, and monitor is going to go off. Also, there are enough people apparently around who just hate you that I'm sure they're going to take a picture of you if they see you in an area where you should not be. Prosecutors believe a dispute over a takeout order in November became an obsessive point of contention for Hirsch, leading to the alleged crimes, and requested he be held without bail. That's what concerned lawmakers, including Congresswoman Grace Meng, were hoping for. There are concerns that uh, he may pose a danger either to the uh, employees of that restaurant or the family or just to everyday Queens neighbors. His attorney says he's happy with the outcome. I thought the judge made a nice compromise about public safety versus the rights of an individual not convicted of a crime. Our position is that he's not the guy who did this. Queens District Attorney Melinda Katz said any violation of the terms or conditions could mean bail being revoked. Outside Queens County Criminal Court, Jenna DeAngelis, CBS 2 News.